just got one of our guys. So I need to start my counter sniping. That T1 like caused us a lot of problems because he spotted two of our guys really quickly and they got taken out. So see right, right there. That was a T1 Cunningham light tank that's shooting from back over there. So I think he's somewhat behind that rock, so I can't really take that shot and give away like my position to be counter sniped. See he just knocked over that tree. So either he's moved Let's see. I need to keep watching up over there. Aha. Ready to fire See, on tractor. See, now this is a problem for us. Dropping target. They destroyed one of our tanks. Yeah. We've got a lock. What happened was one of our tanks went out like too early. And then, like, we weren't all in positions yet, so... They were taken out easily before that they could help the team at all. So now we just got tanks shooting from over there towards us. So that guy's trying to like reset the capturing because if you shoot them while they're in the cap and do like hit them and do damage then it resets it from how long they've been in there so it doesn't count for them anymore. That's where I think they're going to be coming from next, so I want us to like move into a position somewhat like over here behind some stuff, you know, to where they can't really hit us from across the map. And then I'm just gonna try to kind of like wait. See, right here is not really a good spot for me though because I can get shot in the side. But I have my camo net up, so I'm a lot harder to see, and I'm stationary, so I can see farther. So I'll probably see them before they see me. But yeah, if I was them, they're probably gonna be coming up over this way. Because, yeah, they have two medium ones and a T-22 Proto, and unless those guys have been shot, basically. Alright. I really hope my teammate doesn't try to do anything without me, though, because the like, key's been damaged, and I don't can't tell what type of tank he's in. Okay, that's a medium one. So, yeah, see, that's what I was kind of worried about. I'm just like trying to get there so I can like kind of see where he is. See, apparently I can't even hit him right now. He's like right there. But 
like incredibly difficult for me right now. Target has moved away. See that reset it, but now. Let's just go ahead and be crazy. So yeah, I was kind of crazy and now I know that I'm getting shot at from up over there. So they hit my ammo rack so I shouldn't really repair it at this point in time. I'm only at 6 health, so I can't really do anything except for, like, try to hold these guys off. And if I was correct, they will be coming up from over there and now from that side or straight through the middle. But there's always the chance one of their players is AFK, which would be that medium one. So, means it's just me and that Type 22. And he knows I'm like about to die, so all he needs is one shot. So I have to be very careful while going up this hill. And try not to hit any trees or anything like that. So this forces me into a corner basically because like I could get shot from over there or just taken out from right over there right now. So what I'm going to do is go back over here and then just probably test fire my gun to see how long my reload is now. Or I could actually just switch ammo. Alright, see, yeah, uh, now I have a four second reload. Up the camo net. Which is definitely way less than what their reload is, so... Yeah. kind of like a waste of silver, but if I can still pull off a victory, then it's worth it. So let's see, if I go here, I can actually probably... See, I think he's thinking I'm going to go for their base now, probably. So let's see. See, like, right here is a pretty good spot for, like, shooting towards that way. Because I can actually, like, shoot down towards my base a little bit. And then I have these rocks right here to, like, want guard me from getting shot from over there. But if, like, he was to start driving up this hill, I'd be probably spotted easily. Let's see. So I'm pretty sure he's back over there now, or either making his way towards my base, but we might just end up having a stalemate. Or he could somehow get up here without me seeing him. 
and then basically one shot me now unless I get really lucky and his shot bounces but since he has a heavier gun than I do it'd be very 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 unlikely for him to not kill me in that first shot unless it just misses because most likely it won't bounce off unless my tracks eat it so my tracks take damage instead of me so now it's just kind of a waiting game to see who makes the first move and most likely it will not be me because I have no health so this might just end up becoming a draw so he might actually just still be in that same spot waiting for me to like try to move but most likely I think he's like waiting right over here in like a corner or like Maybe he moved up over here. But he was along there. So. I don't think he could go back up that hill, probably. But he might have been able to. So he might just be down in the middle area somewhere. He might just be waiting until, like, the. A little bit closer to the one minute mark to go in for the like the flag. Let's see. I got a message from someone that I don't know, so I can check that real quickly. Oh, I think he's the other player. Yeah, that's someone from the other team trying to figure out where I am. So we can probably tell the other guy so that they can get the victory, but you know. If you don't think you're going to win, you have no health, you can always just go to hide and try to like make it a draw. That way, you know, it stops the other team from getting the victory which can be pretty rewarding especially when it's a one on two situation like this and I only have six health so I'm gonna go for the draw see as of now they aren't gonna be able to capture my base so they could only win by killing me so either he drove around the base and is trying to find me or he's still in that same spot he might not be able to catch up to me So let's just 30 seconds. I can't take damage from going down a hill. So I might, I don't want to end up killing my own tank. So I just want to be like this in case he comes from right over there. Alright, so I just got us a draw. Wahoo! So, yeah. So, yeah. Got the Defender Medal. I destroyed two tanks, and you know, yeah. Got the draw. Alright, so I already did the FT, so we can try the MS-1 now, which is the Russian tank. Let's see now. 